it allows patients who don't have access to regular dental coverage um, or who don't have the funds to pay for an exam out of pocket an opportunity to get screened for oral cancer at no charge. For the first time since 2019, the Manitoba Dental Association and Never Alone Cancer Foundation are bringing back its annual oral cancer screenings. People who don't go to the dentist regularly, um, they can come in and, and we can have a look and assess them if they're concerned about any changes in the mouth or any lumps or bumps they may feel around their face or their jaw. Dentist Dr. Daryl Iwaskiu says the exam is open to people of all ages and takes up to five minutes. The examination will include a visual and tactile exam done by a dentist with um, assistance by dental hygienists and dental assistants. If there's any cause for concern, the patients are then referred to oral surgery at Health Sciences Centre for further investigation. Dr. Iwaskiu says screenings are important. She says oral cancer is more prevalent in males over 50 and people who smoke and drink, but recently she's been seeing HPV-related oral cancer in younger people. We're seeing a lot of cancers related to that in a demographic that wasn't given an opportunity to get vaccinated for HPV. The demographic that's above 50 right now obviously didn't have that opportunity, so it is very important to get screened even if you're not a smoker or drinker because you could be more prone to it if you do have HPV in the mouth. You wouldn't know if you had it. Early detection is sometimes tricky. Uh, dentists are trained to, to spot the, the early signs and get the, so patients have the best outcome and get the best recovery prognosis. Dr. Richard Santos says dentists screen for oral cancer during appointments and look for patches and bumps. Usually by the time patients are able to feel there's something in their mouth, that's often later than we want it to be. Um, we're looking as dentists at things, uh, we're often able to spot things before patients even know that they're visible. Dr. Santos says screening should happen regularly and recommends people try to get to the dentist when they can. It's definitely worth getting checked out. Very often it's nothing, but it's just better to be safe than sorry. Both Dr. Iwaskiu and Dr. Santos will be at Garden City Shopping Centre on Saturday for free oral cancer screenings. Both say they hope for a high turnout so more people can get screened and become more aware. Dr. Iwaskiu says if people aren't able to come to the screening or go to the dentist, people can also go to their family doctor for a checkup. In Winnipeg, Joanne Roberts, City News.